members. Mr. Lampkin, I'm Kevin Rice at 1228 Crescent Avenue, Clifton Forge. I'm also a school board employee, and I've debated whether I should stand here and say remarks this evening. I had not planned to when I came. Uh, but sometimes you have to stand and be counted, even if there is a cost to you personally. So I'm going to stand and be counted tonight. And, um, and I want to uh, speak on behalf of Mr. Lane, who has put his name in the hat this evening for reappointment to the school board. And these are not normal times, as you know. And we have suffered a lot of turmoil on this board. And this has nothing to do with the other applicant. I do not know him. He may be the finest person in the world. But I know Mr. Lane. And he's been a steady influence on our board throughout all this. He's been thoughtful. He's asked questions. And we need his steady influence on our board going forward because we can't continue to have the turmoil we've had. And we are all here this evening because <coughs> we all feel strongly about that. And we're frustrated. We're stressed, stressed out. We have anxiety sometimes. And it's been a difficult time. But we're all here being counted. And I ask you to consider that when you consider your appointment for the school board again. Mr. Lane has done well in his four years. He's earned the right, and we need his steady influence on the board. Thank you. Anyone else wish to comment on any topic? So it's about five minutes, within five minutes. Chairman, board members, I'm Elizabeth Keith. I live at 1311 Forster Road, Clifton Forge. I would echo what Mr. Rice has said. The last few months have been very difficult for myself, for Mr. Rice, and for some other members of the staff at the school board office. Mr. Lane has been a great gentleman and very supportive and very helpful. And I, too, do not know the other candidate. But I'm a bit afraid of the unknown right now because an unknown got us in a lot of hot water. So I would greatly appreciate your support to continue Mr. Lane's position. 